In this video, let's see a numerical problem based on the concept of differentiation of implicit functions. The problem was asked in the CBSE previous year examination, the year was 1990. The question says, if ax square plus by square plus 2hxy plus 2gx plus 2fy plus c equal to 0, find dy by dx. Now, this type of question, as you can see, has many terms involved. One is related to x square, the other for y square, the other for xy and so on. I know that had the question been simple, I mean x square, y squared, x, y was there, no issues with it. But because of this one term, 2hxy, wherein x and y cannot be separated, this type of questions falls in the category of implicit function. An implicit function is of the form f of xy, that means I want to say you that it is something like this as we did in the previous video. So wherein you have x and y involved in one expression term and you cannot separate it. Now let's see how to do it. The simple criteria to solve such type of question is directly differentiating with respect to x or whatever is needed along the both sides. Let's start. I write the Eddinger solution and I say that differentiating differentiating with respect to x. What happens? Let's see. Ax square is there. Now Ax square has A as the constant but x square needs to be differentiated with respect to x. You know that the differentiation of x square is 2x. Next B y square. So B acts as a constant but y square is not a constant, right? y square is a variable term. The differentiation is what? It is 2y because of the same formula but y again needs to be differentiated. So we are basically following the chain rule for it. We started with this, we saw b we wrote here. y square I said is something like which has to be differentiated and y with respect to x again has to be differentiated. Let me make it clear friends that d by dx of x square is 2x. Why? Because x square means power formula which is 2x and then x again with respect to x is 1 only. But if I say that I have to calculate d by dx of y square, it has to be taken care that first we are going to apply power formula so it becomes 2y, then differentiation of y again so it becomes dy by dx because y with respect to x gives me dy by dx. That has to be taken care. Because of that same thing, let me apply this here so it becomes multiply by dy by dx. Right? Now next term is 2hxy. 2hxy has 2h as a constant. Then you have x and y both. Now x and y both when you need to multiply and they are already in the u into v that is product form. So you have to apply the product rule. So it is x into differentiation of y x into differentiation of the second term plus the second term into differentiation of first wherein the first term is x so differentiation of x is 1 with respect to x. Next is plus 2gx so it is plus 2g differentiation of x with respect to x is 1 so we are not writing it. Next is plus 2fy so plus 2f differentiation of y with respect to x is dy by dx. Next is plus c. Now plus c, wherein we know c is a constant, so its differentiation is 0, is equal to 0 only. Now see wherever terms you can take something is common, in which all terms. So you have dy by dx here, dy by dx here, dy by dx here. These can be taken as common. From here we can take dy by dx as common. So let's take it out as common. So it becomes dy by dx, 2by, let me make it more clear, it is 2by, the first term is 2by plus if dy by dx comes out as common it becomes 2hx plus from here dy by dx is common it becomes 2f, right? Next, next I have the other left out terms so let me write it as 2ax so plus 2ax then is plus 2hy plus 2g 
equal to 0 because plus 0 also need not be considered. Now dy by dx we need to find out. So for that dy by dx will remain here only and these all terms which do not include dy by dx will go to the other side of the equation. So it becomes minus 2ax plus 2hy plus 2g. In the denominator you have what 2by plus 2hx plus 2f. So this is basically your answer for dy by dx. Now I know that for dy by dx what I needed to do? I needed to find out the differentiation of the implicit function. 